Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Yeah. All right, so I'm trying to get all these videos done tonight so that we can start fresh and get some more content up in here. Okay, okay. So we're starting off with a orange. This orange is from, uh, what's the name of that place? I can't think of the name of the place, but their collection is called Geely, I think, or Glee or something like that. I had seen one of these jars on Lovely Mimi's page and I researched it and I found it. And yeah, so I bought the jars. The jars was like $18, but I also bought them back in 2020 and it's 2022. So they lasted a very long time and they're not done yet. So yeah, this is a freestyle set for her birthday. Um, tame the top, tame the top, bring it on down, bring it on down. Yes, 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 yes. I, I had absolutely no idea as to what I was going to do to these nails. So yeah, please be mindful, be nice. And yes, we are out of frame a lot in this. We are out of frame a lot. And I do apologize about that. Cuticle bead. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Seal it, seal it, seal it. Yes, 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 yes. Seal it, seal it, seal it. Bring it on down, bring it on down. Clean it up. You can't see it, but y'all make sure y'all clean up them beads. Okay? Okay. Like I said, I had absolutely no idea as to what it was going to do, so I had to take a break. And then I came back. We're going to put some foil around it. And she laughed, and all my foil went away. All my foil ran away. So yeah, right now we're putting the foil on the outline. It's kind of like a um, a really cute little razzle dazzle, little razzle dazzle. So yeah, we're gonna put it all the way up to the edges. We're not gonna go all the way around the cuticle, just around the free edge of the nail. Yes, ma'am. And with this set, I am encapsulating as I go. It's like I'll let the nail dry a little bit, and then I'll come back and encapsulate it. I'm trying to make sure you guys get the good angle. The good angle. Yes, ma'am. The good angle. So, yeah, I'm just tapping it in, tapping it in, making sure that it's not going to go anywhere. So, yeah. We are on my travel nail station, so I didn't zoom in because there's no reason to. We're already close as can be. So, yep, we're going to encapsulate it. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Seal it, seal it, seal it. Bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down. Unsure as to why I didn't have enough, but I didn't. So, yep, we're going to put it at the top. Feather it up. Let the nail go downward and let that acrylic run on down like it's supposed to. And get knocked out like your daddy used to. Y'all, I'm sorry. Movies live in my head rent free. <laughs> Movie quotes live in my head rent free, so I can't even. I don't know. And I do apologize for it being cut off real bad. Like, real, real bad. That's crazy to me. So we did another B. We're going to tame it, tame it, tame it, tame it, tame it, seal it, seal it, seal it, and bring it on down, bring it on down. Um, I did make these nails a little bit thicker because her, um, her uh, significant other does have. A medical problem right now so she's helping them a lot and i didn't want her to break any nails because she didn't want them long still so yeah just wanted to make sure that she could you know do what she needs to do and still have cute nails you feel me so yeah like i said this mess is really just like out of frame and i do apologize because yeah and I put even more clear acrylic on top of that. Only because I want it to be a certain thickness. And if it's not a certain thickness, I'm going to make it that thick as much as I need it to be. Okay, there we go. Somebody called me. I'm sorry, guys. Somebody, you know. Yeah, somebody had called me. And here go the fan on my computer. Acting up. But we back now. We back. Got off the phone. And got everything situated so we're gonna do like a marble type of thing and have us a, a clear surroundings around it and we're gonna add some gold foil around this yeah just like that it looks real cute uh, you guys will see the finishing product and see how cute it is you can't really see it from right now from where we are right now but just know it, it came out really cute so we're gonna outline that with some gold foil yes the um what do you call it the the color here is gold the accent color is gold 
the nail theme was definitely yellow and um, orange. The theme was gold, like the accent color is gold. I love a cohesive nail set. I love that. Uh, right now we're gonna do an ombre with the yellow and the gold. The yellow fell. Guess what? We're gonna pick it right back up and put it down. Yes, ma'am. Tap it in, tap it in, tap it in, tap it in, tap it in. Bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down. I'm pretty sure I'll probably recycle that bead. Yep. That's exactly what I thought. Bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down. Yep. Make sure we're covering up the sides. Make sure we're doing what we need to do. Keep the shape. Now we're going to put that orange right there on top. Why? Because we need to make sure it blends in. Look at that. Looks so good. And then I mess it up and I'm trying to fix this nail for freaking five minutes. Look at it. Just getting messed up. It. Oh my god, I'm sorry, the um, fan on my computer is getting louder and louder. Louder and freaking louder. Had to put that cuticle uh, bead up there. We're going to tame it. We're going to seal it with the brush. Seal it, seal it, seal it. Pat it in, pat it in, pat it in. We're going to bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down. Yep, bring it down, bring it down. I'm not sure what was in the nail, but we're going to get it out. We're going to get that mess out. Yes, we is. All right, so there I am trying to clean up some of that orange. I don't want it to be super freaking orange. So there, we're going to put that bead at the bottom. And we're going to fade it up. We're going to fade it up. Yep. That didn't really do too much, so we got to put a bead of orange. Fade it up, fade it up. Oh, I messed it up. Oh, it was a long night. Oh, my God. There I am putting monomer on it, trying to clean it up some more. Okay. We're going to try it again. We're going to try it again. All right. Clean it up. Clean it up. Clean it up. We're going to put that orange right there. And we're just going to bring it down. Bring it down. Yep. Just like that. I don't know if we're going to do something. I think we're going to do something else. I think I need to put that yellow. That yellow. There we go. And bring that yellow up. There we go. There we go. Now we got sunset vibes. Now we got sunset vibes. Real cute. Are we going to do glitter on the last two nails on the thumb and the pinky? So, yep. Now we need to encapsulate everything else. Encapsulate it. Encapsulate it. Bring it on down. Bring it on down. Bring it on down. Yes, ma'am. Is there ski vibes? Bring it on down, bring it on down, encapsulate all that. Another bead. Right there. Yep, 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 yep. Tame the top, tame the top, pick it up, pick it up, bring it down, bring it down. Bring it down, bring it down. Make sure you're going side to side, side to side, side to side. Mm-hmm. Keep the shape, keep the shape. Clean it up. Yes, ma'am. And now we need to do our cuticle bead right after this. Right there. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Seal it, seal it, seal it. Seal that cuticle, baby. Seal it, baby. Yep, just like that. Bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down. Yes, ma'am. Yes, there's key vibes. Now we're going to encapsulate this one. We're going to put it at the top because we didn't really need a lot of encapsulation because we did use a lot of acrylic already uh, during the ombre process because I messed it up. Anyways, bring it down, bring it down, bring it down, bring it down. This, uh, I feel like I was using some Speed Clear by um, Young Nails and when they say speed, they mean speed, okay? You see how fast that thing started hardening up on me? I'm like, okay. And then I'm like, girl, I can't use this. It's too much. It's too fast for me. I like to take my time. So, yeah. I like to take my goddamn on time, baby. 
That mess was so hard, so fast. Ain't nothing I can see. I just pulled that right off. Ain't nothing. There's nothing I can do to that. I'm like, oh, you're playing fastball. Clean up beat. Yes, ma'am. The fan on this computer is getting louder and louder. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Now I'm going to show you guys how to do the ombre again. And how to do that orange nail with the trimming on it. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right here. That's the only thing I'm going to show you on this hand. But yeah. We put that yellow down. We tame the top. Tame the sides. Put the sides in. Make sure we still have the color on the sides. And bring it down. Bring it down, bring it down, bring it down, bring it down, bring it down. Yep, just like that. Clean it up, clean it up. Sorry, you guys can't see. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This was one of the not so good angles in terms of my videos. So yeah, we go take it. Down. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm excuse me. I'm sorry. Take that orange, put it right on top, and we're gonna blend it down. Blend it down, blend it down. Cuticle bead right on top. Seal it, seal it, seal it, seal it, seal it. Seal that thing all the way around. Bring it down, bring it down, bring it down. There we go. We're gonna clean up some of that yellow. And we're going to bring that orange all the way down. Yep. I think I put just a little bitty yellow on there. Just to clean it up. Just to give it that oomph. Another bitty yellow right there in the middle. Yes, ma'am. Bring it up. Bring it up. There we go. And bring it down. That ombre looks good to me. On to the next nail. Next nail will be all orange. So with that one. See me put my bead down, my first bead down, and we're gonna bring it on down, bring it on down. Uh, what is the name? I'm still trying to figure out the name of that acrylic, like the website and stuff. Mm, it's really not coming to me, but I do, I have used this uh acrylic in other videos, not not this specific color, but I because I bought like maybe five of them, five of the six of the colors actually, I bought six of the colors. So if you want to go know what the name of the brand is. You probably have to find another video because I really can't even think right now. Lay up, seal it, seal it, seal it, seal it, seal it. Take your time, take your time. And bring it down, bring it down, bring it down. Yes, ma'am. Yes, Erski vibes. Yep. And I think I need to put another bead at the bottom because it looks a little transparent down there. Yep. Right there. Clean it up, clean it up. Yep. Just like that. You're going to take some of the little foil that's sitting down there and we're going to line not trimming up we're gonna line it up right fast just like that not too much we're gonna cut another piece because we we out not me trying to show y'all and show the girls how to cut the the foils we gotta cut some more foil because i got another nail that i gotta uh use it for so i'm gonna go ahead and cut it up get it right get it tight Alright, here we go. Put the foil down on the side for the trimming. Lay it down, lay it down. Lay it down on this side. Make sure they connect. Tap them in, tap them in, tap them in. I don't think I show you guys how I encapsulate it. I think this is the end of that part. I hope it's the end, because Lord. Then again, I don't think it is. Oh, it was. Okay, great. Now we're using our glitter. We got I got this glitter from uh nail supply glamour. Oh, Nail Supply Glamour. I'm talking about we got it from Nail Supply Glamour. Ain't no we, it's just me. Oh my God, this fan is getting louder and louder. Y'all, I've been doing a lot of work tonight. I'm trying to get all these videos out to y'all. Uh, I think I got one more to um put the voiceover on. And we'll be done. Just one more. And I might actually put the voiceover on now on my phone so we can avoid hearing the fan. So yeah, we gonna encapsulate, tap it in, tap it in, tap it in. We did the one beat method because this freaking uh, speed acrylic sets so fast. Like, young nails, 
They named that right. Speed acrylic. Okay. Look at that. It's hard already. It's hard. I just put that on there. I think I'm just so used to using acrylics that don't harden as fast that this one was really difficult to use. But yeah. All nails have been fully encapsulated. We got one more to do. One more glitter nail. And my brush is dirty. That's why the acrylic is now sticking to it. Bring it on down. Bring it on down. Bring it on down. Bring it on down. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Tap, 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 tap. Tap, 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 tap. Bring it down. Bring it down. Bring it around town. Yes, ma'am. Up, 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 up. And we about to encapsulate it. You know what? I'm not even using Speed Clear no more. I'm using Mia Seeker because I see the Mia Seeker jar over there. So is this Mia Seeker that then got fast on me? Or I might have switched it out already. Oh, and their house was a uh, warmer temperature, so... That also can play a part into the rate, the speed and rate of the uh, nails curing. One more beat. Tame it, 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 tame it. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Seal it, seal it, seal it. And bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down. Yes, ma'am. Bring it down. Bring it down. Oh, just like that. Clean it up. Clean it up. Yes, ma'am. Alright. We're going to put these acrylics up. Close everything up. And get the reshaping. Yes, ma'am. Right now, I'm using my 8080 grit hand file. I'm trying to show you guys. Get a better angle. Alright, there we go. I'm taking this file and I am focusing on where the natural nail and the tip meet. So yep, that's me getting my good shape. That's how I get the good shape. And I tape I taper the freaking hand file inward when I'm filing so that it does crispen up my shape. Now that I need to reshape them because they had a good shape on them even with the acrylic on them. But right now I'm just trying to make sure they're not too thick. Yes, ma'am. Taper it in, taper it in. Mm-hmm. Hit them free edges real quick. And then go in and hold that dang on hand file inward so we can get exactly what we need to get every single time. Every time, every time. Yep, we're doing a thumb. It's a little out of frame, but y'all get the gist. Okay. Here we go, e foul. We're gonna use our sanding band. Then we're gonna go across the top, go across the top. I probably should have zoomed in, but we're back in frame now. So, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead, do our thing, go across the top, go across the top, bring down some of the bulk around that cuticle. So, when I bring out my uh, next bit, I could just seal it. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Like I told you guys, I'm getting real comfortable with that e-file. Yes, I am. Go around the top, going around, going around. Hit them, hit that. Yep. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Hit it, hit it, hit it. I keep stopping because they're probably talking. Or I might be talking crap because that's what I do. I like to talk crap. <laughs> yep. All right. Boom, 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 boom. Thumb time, thumb time. Yes, ma'am. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Go across, go across. Smooth it out. Yes, ma'am. Smooth it out. Hit the thing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We're going to change the bit. Go around, go around. You guys, I do want to let you know that I forgot to leave in... Well, I forgot to record the... Um me putting on the, the rhinestone so my apologies but this video is coming to an end i did put the finishing product at the end as well so 
So I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in. And I hope you guys have a great day. Please subscribe, like, comment, share. Whatever you feel in your heart, please do in regards to this video. Because this is a really good video in terms of, like, the nails look that good. The video itself was a little off, so. But I still wanted to share because it's cute. There I am wiping off the cuticles with an um, alcohol wipe. Yep, 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 yep. But like I said, like, comment, share, subscribe. I appreciate you guys. Want to roll to 500 subscribers? 500. So yeah, top coat Beatles per use. Beatles top coat. Uh, the rhinestone gel I use is McCart. So yeah, I'm gone. So bye.